I'm sending a huge thank you out to all those How To Prank It Up subscribers. We're almost 3 million strong. And if you haven't subscribed yet, what are you waiting for? Hit that subscribe button and please give this video a thumbs up. So you want to know how to prank. Today I'm with Furious Pete and Crazy Russian Hacker. We're back at VidCon. I'm going to show you how to do some cell phone pranks on your friends and family. Let's do it! For this cell phone prank, of course we need a cell phone and we need rubber bands. What is this? Hair bands. Or, or hair bands, whatever stages. So what we're gonna do is just put a ton of them. Get like a thousand of them or two thousand. I know it might take all day, but it will be worth it. And you wanna mix it up. Few like this, few like this, and just keep putting them on. So the objective of this prank is to take your friend's cell phone and just wrap it up with as many rubber bands as you can. And or you hair. you want to twist it up so that That's it's a good not one. easy to take it off. That's a good idea. I like how you're twisting it. That's it. Look at this. Whoa, dude, this is great, man. You can't even tell it's a cell phone. This is awesome. Yo, Taras, you know another twist to this would be? What? Is to turn the cell phone alarm on. So wrap this phone up at like one or two in the morning when the person's sleeping. Oh, that's a really good idea. Yeah. When they wake up, they cannot get and turn it off. Exactly. So they're going to wake up. Oh. They got to peel this thing off. Then it's a guaranteed headache. Film it. How you turn dude, it? I take can't it even off. hold the camera. So they gotta like, the alarm's going off, they gotta peel those off, it's 2 in the morning, they're like, darn, this stupid alarm clock is, this is gonna be... Look, you can't even do it. Yeah, well, it's cause, you know. This is so actually awesome, yeah, wow. So maybe I'll just go like this. Wait. You can't. It's wow. gonna take beep, you so beep. long. This phone, oh. 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 Dude, you just broke your phone. Still didn't come off. <laughs> Still didn't come off. Oh, what a good one. Look, they're gonna be... So pissed, and you're gonna laugh your butt off and watch someone get frustrated at two in the morning when they're tired. That's the best reaction when they're tired. All right, guys, so for this prank, you're first going to order one of these fake phones. You can get them online everywhere, they're super, super cheap, and they make this prank hilarious. They work, I mean, these are real. They look, they feel real. They like, they look and feel real. Like, you, I, like, we have to check to make sure that this was a fake one. Yeah. So, what you're gonna do is take your friend's phone and you're gonna hide it. You're gonna hide it, and then you're going to take this phone and you're gonna drop it in the toilet. Oh, you got it on my like... leg! Oh. <laughs> <laughs> and and as an added bonus, you're gonna grab like a Snickers bar or a chocolate bar, and you're gonna put that <laughs> into the toilet as well. So it looks like there's a big turd right beside the phone. Oh no. Oh, how good is that? Look at this. Oh. <laughs> it looks like corn. Oh. 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 that is so good. Dude, that is, that is so good. Okay. So, oh. so your friend is running around. They're like, where's my phone? Where's my phone? And then you go, hey, I, I think I found it. I think I found it in the toilet. Where? Where, where man? Drop. They can drop. Oh, what the hell? Oh. Oh, you want to go grab it, but who's you're like, gonna go up? who's going to grab it? Like, no one's going to grab it with the toilet in there. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Give this video a thumbs up if you stick your hand in the toilet to get your phone out too. If you have an iPhone and you use iMessage, this is the symbol you'll see when somebody's typing. It's letting you know, hey, wait a minute, they're about to send you a message. But this right here is actually just a picture. And what you do is you send this picture to your friend and they're going to be sitting there thinking you're about to say something and they're going to wait and wait and wait and wait for your message to come out. But there is no message. It's just a picture. You're leaving them on a hook. What you can do is go to Google and type in the iMessage now typing symbol and just pick whichever website you want to find it. And you can download it, uh, the symbol, or copy and paste it depending on where you're going. And once you do that, you'll have the image. So all you gotta do is copy paste it, and then you can send it to any of your friends. Uh, I got Pete right there, that's what it looks like. And they're gonna be sitting there thinking, when is this message gonna come through? Why is it taking so long? What the heck, man? For this cell phone prank, all we need is a marker. What we're going to do is grab the top of the cell phone and mark it. 
You need a black cell phone. It will not work with the white cell phone. You can't even see it, man. Don't yep. cover the camera, though. Yeah, I'm not. But we want to mark oh. it all, all the way so it's matching to the everything. Oh my gosh, dude, that ear is going to be completely black. And then you leave it on a table and you want to call this phone before it will dies out. So your friend picks it up and like, hello? Oh, hello? you did it. <laughs> <laughs> is it bad? That's <laughs> permanent marker, dude. <laughs> so you see permanent marker, then I'm gonna get the it. Oh, that that is easily. awesome, dude. <laughs> so for this prank, I took Taras's phone and I changed Pete's phone number to the adult sex toy shop. So when he's calling Pete, he's gonna be sitting there waiting. He's expecting Pete to answer. Thanks for calling Romantic. This is Erica. How can I help you? Uh, er Erica? What, what number is this? Who is this? This is Romantic. What's, what's that? A sex shop. So I was expecting to call my buddy Pete, now I'm calling a sex shop. Yes. Well, I'll use that phone number. <laughs> <laughs> so for the last prank, you changed the contact's phone number to something else, like a sex shop. For this prank, you go to your friend's phone and you just change all the names up in the phone. So when they think they're calling dad, they're really calling mom. When they think they're calling their brother, they're really calling their sister. So yeah, it's either gonna change the contact name or you're gonna change the contact number. Have fun. All right, everybody, let us know what your favorite prank was in the comments below. Pete, which one was your favorite? I love the one with uh, the phone in the toilet bowl. Ugh, the that was a good one. That was yeah. such a funny one. Actually, this is my favorite which as one? well. Oh, oh you like that one? Yeah, that's yeah. the best. That's mine too. Let us know what your favorite was in the comments below. Make sure you subscribe to the Crazy Russian Hacker. Subscribe to the Furious Pete. Let us fire shock the world. See you next time. Peace out. So for this prank, we're going to put a sign on the back of your dad's car. It's going to be like a kick me sign but less violent. But the idea is not to let your dad see the sign back there, so he drives to work, everyone's honking at him when he's driving. That's it. Yeah, so your dad's gonna be driving to work going, why is everybody honking at me?